some small animals? What kind of whack job waterboards Chip and Dale? That makes Guyliner here like the most uncoolest dude ever! Welcome to the Mosh Pits! Alright, Zez, the first official boss of the game. How about that? What the fuck? That wasn't too bad. I bet he does a shitload of damage, though. Fuck! You know what, the, okay, so I, I'll be honest, during the cutscene, le leading up to the boss battle, that kind of reminded me of Dead Rising. I'm sure some of you that have seen that series from me... Damn, he's just taking it deep! Oh! It just had, it just had Dead Rising written all over it, except it's not, it doesn't, it's not as serious. I think Dead Rising took itself very serious, which is what made that game kind of stand out. Oh, shit! I'm about to make this dude take it deep! <laughs> no! Oh, shit! Oh, we're good. Fuck you, letters. Fuck the alphabet. Take this whore! This dude is about to just get on my chair breaking list. Oh shit, the spear. I feel like I'm doing a lot of damage to him. I'm sure he has like six forms or some bullshit. Wait for it! Take this whore! Oh fuck. Scared me for a minute. I was like, what the fuck? Oh, what? Finish. There it goes, bitch! Right down the fucking middle. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Holy shit, that dude's fucked. You think that hurts me? I just jizzed a little. I knew we had another form. What the fuck? Your mohawk looks like a rooster thingamabob. This is just absolute nuts. Your pain is my eyes. I can't keep up with him if he fucking does that. Smash that speaker stand. Sweet! Destroy the speakers! So basically, I'm just going to keep going wherever he goes, and I'm going to destroy the speaker. It's easy to do that, just keep locking on to him. Now, I actually got to a point where I had destroyed all the speakers, but he just made more appear, so I don't really know exactly why. Fuck, there's too many of them. Got to get him before he does his little attack. Get it, get it. There we go, finally. Julia, let's fuck up that speaker. Play some dubstep on it. That'll fuck it up. <laughs> Wait for it. Join me on stage for a death jam. I can just keep doing this. Get it, get it! There we go! Almost there. Oh, get the fuck out of here, Zed! Zed's dead, baby! How many more times do I have to kill this motherfucker? Look at that, okay. At the beginning of this boss battle, I say he's gonna have like six forms. That's funny because this is the third time that he is, uh, I wouldn't say form, but like the third. Oh shit. What's he doing? Oh, 
I would use my special, but I don't really know if that'll do any good. Here goes nothing. Oh shit, it does so much damage. Come here, bitch. Oh shit! Yeah, take you down, bitch. Yeah, all right, better not be the. This better be it. Zed's dead, baby. Oh shit! They use that Pulp Fiction reference right on point. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> you managed to purify one of the dark purveyors. Yes. <laughs> Look at this. Zed was only the weakest of the dark purveyors. But the other four are here, rotting the school. By now, they've probably transformed all your fellow students into undead. The school is probably filled with zombies. <coughs> Sensei! Mr. Morikawa. Juliet and Nick, I have faith you can stop them. All humans must die, as I must now do. Oh, Sensei, no! Don't leave! Oh, I have this for you, Juliet. <coughs> Happy birthday, Juliet. You were always my favorite pupil. Well, I sucked at this one too. Oh, this was stage one. Okay. Well, hope you guys enjoyed it. Show some love if you can. And I'll definitely, uh, definitely talk to you all next time. You guys take it easy.